KIB signed contracts with Core Civic for the lease agreements for the Tallahassee and Atmore locations, but the Briarfield locations through a separate company, the Alabama Prison Transformation Partners. We know they've drilled two wells on the property that they intend to build the prison on. By law, whenever they drill the well, they're supposed to file paperwork with ADM, which is Alabama Department of Environmental Management. Uh, but the contractor didn't seem to do that in this case. The best information we've gotten is that 300,000 to 500,000 gallons a day could be drawn from there. So they'd be putting a small city, a concentrated number of people right there, um, and they're gonna produce a lot of uh, sewage and wastewater. The wastewater treatment systems at these facilities will um, you know, similarly fall into disrepair. There's a plan to build a prison in Briarfield, um, which would drain to Mayhan Creek, which drains to the Little Cahaba River before it, it reaches the, the main stem of the Cahaba River. Um, a lot of people are, are concerned about many of the same things we are, in addition to other things, the, the strain that it may place on uh, emergency services in those areas, the, the added uh, pressure on roads and infrastructure, 